Hey guys, I'm Tiara, and today I'm going to show you how to add a virtual scene or activity created in Google Slides to Seesaw as an activity. I am going to use the Dr. Seuss reading room activity that was shared in our group Bitmoji Craze for Educators. Let's get started. And if you haven't already logged into your teacher seesaw account go ahead and do that okay so once you are in seesaw you are going to first add the activity um, so you will need to click add then you will click assign activity create new activity and it brings you to this box where you will add the activity after you add the activity and this box pops up, you will you will fill in all this information, which for mine, it is entered in already, but I added the activity name, which is Dr. Seuss Week Reading Activity. And I did it that way because I plan to um, share this activity with them during Dr. Seuss Week. Then you go to student instructions. You add the student instructions explicitly on what you want them to do. I added that information and then I went to how to access the book links because I want them to understand completely how to access the book link and what they would have to do. Then here, you can add your voice instructions. I always add voice instructions because some of them, if they don't read it, then they can hear it. And then here, we're going to go to Add Multimedia Instructions. This is where we're going to add the slide. You're going to click. Then here, you're going to have to upload um, that particular slide. Now, what I'm going to do is go back to my Dr. Seuss reading room because this is what I want to add to my Seesaw activity. I'm going to go to File, and I'm going to download it as a PDF document. And it downloads right at the bottom. Then I'm going to go back to my Seesaw tab, and I'm going to simply click and drag it into my activity box. Now it's here. Then it, it's there for them to, um, they have access to it. Then I'm going to click the green check, which saves it. And it takes a little um, time to do that, but it goes by pretty fast. Okay, once that is done, as you can see, it's uploading. Now that it is there, and again, these directions are here to guide them through it. So now um, you're gonna save it, and it's now ready to be assigned. Now what they have to do, and you can walk them through these steps and then they'll be pretty familiar with it, but what they will have to do is they're going to click on this box, which it says click on the picture. And then it says click view original. So they're going to click on the box. View original is down here. They're going to click on that. And when that comes up, it gives them full access to all the books and links that are on this page. They should be able to click on each one of the links. And it pops up. One fish, two fish, red fish. And that is how you add your slides to a Seesaw activity for your students. 